We are a creative industry that's not really being mentored. Um, and we've been exposed to bad quality clothing, bad finishes, bad fit. You know, you go to fashion weeks, you see some of the designers that, you know, see, you see hemlines that are not finished, threads that are fit, hanging. You know, it's like, it's not on. And somebody's got to do something. And I thought, you know what? Let's start this internship program to instill quality, finishing, fit, and also excellence within the young designers. It's hectic. I don't have to lie. Like construction, like of the garment, is hectic. First thing you have to do your sketches. You have to do um, the patterns. You have to do the mockups to make sure that your thing is going to work out. And then from there, you design the actual garment. And it's difficult because, like, really, we had this thing, whatever. But then, if you're doing something that you love, like, why not? My collections are in celebration of. Work. Workers' Day, which happens on May 1st and June 16. Um, Workers' Day is more about the plight of the women in the workplace today. My collection is very frayed, it's very tattered, it's very worn in. It is indicative of the loads that women carry. Okay, June 16, I called it I See a Different You, mainly because I feel like um, the youth of 1976 were fighting for education and were also fighting for education. It's still the same battle, but now it's more about financial freedom. So I wanted to have a look at that. Plans for the future is to really take this internship program into a reality show TV and to say uh, we do have talent that is worth seeing in South Africa and these young designers will become famous because of the work that they create. Not famous because they want to be famous, very famous because they work hard and they are willing to put in the hours. If you see what happens in the studio every night you'll be surprised that this is what happens here. They work 24-7.